Is Trey Lance ready to lead a Super Bowl contending team at this point? Um, no, but it, this is the preseason, right? Like, this is still the preseason. There's still a few weeks before the season starts, and there's still going to be some growing pains early in the season. We talked about it. In the preseason, all you're seeing are vanilla defenses. When the regular season comes up, you're going to see more complex defenses, different, different types of pressures and different types of blitzes, even different types of disguises. And so you're going to go through a little bit of growing pains, but that's why you have such a great team around him defensively, right. a top 10 defense and then you have that's why you sign back the players that you signed back that's why you have Trent Williams and George Kittle that's why you get Debo Samuel to help get your young quarterback ready for when it really matters right when when early but November football December football and now even January football I think he will be ready when it matters but right now you're still you're still in a lot of ways a rookie figuring out what the game looks like Jeff go ahead yeah, listen, let me take it back a little bit to what Jeremy was just saying. This is much bigger with the Jimmy G situation than I think people understand. It's much more – it's much bigger than just the money. And I get the 24, 26, whatever the money is that he's, he's guaranteed. Shanahan has been involved with this with RG3 and Kirk Cousin being on the same – he understands what happens – if Trey Lance continues to struggle early in the season and what fans are going to are going to be saying, what guys maybe in the locker room are saying, and I get the teams like we've moved on, this is Trey's team. This is, guess what? Them grown men in the locker room who, whose checks depend on playoffs, going to Super Bowls, those kind of things, they they aren't sold out yet, right? So so it, he they understand it's not just the money. It's about moving on so there is no plan B, right? It is Trey Lance's team. We have fully yeah. committed to him. Again, all the draft numbers, all those people are like, oh, they've definitely committed. Not if that dude's still in the locker room. And I've been a guy who said, let's keep Jimmy G in case he doesn't play well. He's, t- he's only taking you to a Super Bowl and, and an NFC Championship game in three years. So when he is healthy, he has done good things for this football team. He may not have the upside. They win. So I'm not really sure what you're looking at. But if I'm if I'm Shanahan sitting in that thing, it's more than just the money. It's can I deal with the distraction for an entire season if Lance doesn't meet the expectations of the fan base and the locker room? It's a great point. Not having Jimmy G there takes all that controversy away and says we're riding with Trey Lance or bust. And that's what they're doing. Well, coming up. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.